This is an update on Greta, the red tail Tiger Shovel Nose Hybrid, 8 years old. She's been doing very well on this tank, actually too well. And she started doing the same thing as uh, the prior hybrid that was taken out of here for a timeout. She's chasing all the fish when they have a, when they have a herring in their mouth and she's trying to get them to release it. Just like pretty much any other hybrid I, uh, I had in this age and uh, size range. So Greta is pretty much, you see how acutely she reacts to the pass to the fish passing by to the tank mates passing by she's looking and looking I only gave her the pellets right now the fish is coming but you can see how uh, her behavior is very very aggressive she's looking for the fish all over the place even though I haven't given any yet and she knows it she knows I only gave the pellets but she also knows Ocean also knows the fish are coming at any any second and she doesn't want to miss a chance. So I'm afraid I'm gonna have I'm gonna have to take her out because she's uh, bothering other fish and she swallows I don't know five, six herring, which is a tremendous amount for her for her size each feeding I'm afraid I'm going to have to take her out and uh, put her in a smaller tank with her brother Three for her.
huge time already. That's five. That's seven. I don't know if she's gonna swallow it, but that's herring number seven in her mouth.
Trying to go for the eight, but her mouth is too full right now. So she dropped it. Seven herring down, down in her tummy. Well, the seventh is still in the mouth, bulging out from the bottom. I'm experimenting with feeding this tank now twice a week because when I do it four times a week. These greedy fish, including Greta, they overeat badly. Really, I mean, just very unhealthy. The uh, Marmoratus, marbled pim catfish, Akara. The Piraiba, well, actually, Piraiba, I want to keep very fat. But Greta, the hybrid. Uh, the channel catfish. The six Akara catfish the uh, three marbled sail fin catfish Laeria spictus even the uh, iridescent shark catfish eats way too much and the gars too look at this one it's ready to blow but she's been overfeeding all her life can't control her the other one looks much better, much more proportionate. Well, anyhow, that's our feeding for tonight and the Greta problem. It's not really a problem, I can tolerate it, but... Uh, she didn't show it today, but uh, other times I've seen her chasing tank mates aggressively. <clears throat> when a tank mate grabs a fish and swims away and Greta senses it, she pursues and tries to get the tank mate to release the fish no matter what, very uh, unapologetically and uh, with a lot of vigor she does that persistency so I think I'm gonna try and take her out and put her in with the uh, with her brother over there on the other side of this tank where the jello is and the other thug is hybrid well, 
that's our story for tonight. Yes, I just uh, threw another of the last three fish in there and Greta took her eighth herring. She's swimming with it in her mouth right now and not letting everybody, anybody else get close to, to her prize number eight. Come on, you're gonna show it to us? Or stay in the corner. Well, you're gonna have to trust me that she's got a pairing number eight in her mouth right now. What a greedy, greedy thug. She just barely finished swallowing number seven or maybe even still working on it and now she's got number eight in her mouth.